Carlissa considers having a few words with Carter's teacher after she claims she's wearing a toupee. Gotta wait till we get a million people on here. When I when y'all see me moving my nose like this, that's mean I'm mad. Whenever y'all see me doing this to my nose, oh look at the rainbow all over me. Whenever y'all see me doing this, that mean I'm mad. Girl, why Carter's teacher gonna tell him his grandma wear a toupee? <laughs> this ain't no toupee. Don't listen to your teacher. This is not no toupee, Carter. What did what your teacher tell you is on my head? Toupee. <laughs> Girl, his teacher done told him this is not a wig, this is a toupee. I'm on my way up here to talk to this <laughs> Girl, a toupee? That's what y'all white calling these um lace fronts, toupees? Girl, I'm on my way up here to snatch this hoe. <laughs> Girl, don't you never tell my grandson his grandmother wear a toupee. Go tell her, that's not a wig, Carter, that's a toupee. And did you take up for me? <laughs> what you tell her? Uh, my grandma I don't. Have to do with this. <laughs> you should have told. Next time you say, my grandma don't wear no toupee. <laughs> it's a a lace frontal. Help. Okay. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Girl, I'm on my way up here to snatch this. I'm gonna drop Junie off first because we got problems at the schoolhouse, honey. The elementary teacher done told him his grandma wear a toupee, y'all. <laughs> Girl finna show out. She up there and told this boy his grandma wear a toupee in front of all the kids or just privately, Carter? In front of all the kids? See, that's because you keep getting on her nerves. That's what it is. If you keep getting on your teacher nerves, she going to make fun of you. Okay? She going to do it in a little slick, sly way. That means you ain't sitting down when she tell you to sit down. You ain't shutting up when she tell you to shut up. You thinking about it, huh? Look, you thinking about it. <laughs> Girl. I'm on my way up here to give her a wig lesson 101, honey. I'm going to pull it up on the internet. I'm going to show this teacher, honey. This is not no toupee. That what y'all wear is a toupee. This is a lace frontal, Miss. What's her name? Miss Angie. Miss Angie, this is a toupee. <laughs> I mean, this is a lace frontal. <laughs> I don't even know what no toupee look like y'all that's fucked up matter of fact i'm just gonna snatch it off and go in the classroom how about that should i do that should i snatch it off when i go in the classroom and just walk in without it and then bam it on her desk and say look at here this ain't no toupee you see this lace in the front this mean it's a lace fronto okay 500 to a <laughs> thousand Y'all, just because I don't be laying the lace down because I be making quick runs don't they mean... Know, they know. Oh, we gonna go to the one over here, my bad. Girl, she done told my baby. That's because that's cause he in there getting on her nerves. She said, I'm gonna fix you on a low low. Because see, if I was a teacher, that's how I would fix, fix the, um, the little kids that don't be quiet either. That's why your mama wear a toupee. That's what she did. <laughs> And I bet you sat down and didn't say nothing else. No, he gonna throw me under the bus and say I ain't his mama. I'm his grandmama. <laughs> that ain't my mama. That's my grandmama. You was supposed to say no. Neither one of them don't wear no toupees. Do toupees got lace fronts on them, y'all? I don't know what a toupee is. I know. I'm about to show her what a toupee is. I'm about to show the whole class what a toupee is. If you would have told me this before we left, I would have got my glue and laid this mother down you hear me if you would have told me that before we got in the car i would have put some glue on it and showed 
But I got another plan. I'm gonna snatch it right on off, right in front of that classroom. <laughs> don't you want me to do it or don't do it? <laughs> Girl, I be tired in the morning time. I don't have time to lay this thing down, okay? I need somebody to send me one you ain't gotta lay down. Okay, because when I jump up in the morning, it's either going to be this or a bonnet. He don't want me to wear the bonnet. Okay, he said he don't want the bonnet, so it's going to be slapped on. Okay, because when I get back home, I got to work out, clean up, do stuff. I don't want this lace and glue all on my forehead early in the morning. Is that what y'all doing for the kids? <laughs> okay, Sarah Jakes, take it off. Girl, I know y'all is not over there putting the lace on to go to the schoolhouse. I know y'all ain't. The teacher call, is calling you bald. Girl, she call, she calling me something. I'm about to rip this off and show her I got hair under here, lady. I just don't want to uh, deal with it because it hurt. I'm tender-headed. Do y'all know what tender-headed is? Huh? Katie and Karen, do y'all know what tender-headed is? No, you don't know what it is because all you do is comb through your little stringly hair and... And then it don't hurt, okay? But to comb through my hair, we need grease, we need conditioner, we need water, we need a lot of stuff, okay? Don't get on here acting like, just cause we tender headed, we ain't got no hair. I got some hair under here. And it shrinkage and it goes all the way up to my brain sometimes. But if I pull it down, it's gonna come down, okay? I got some braids under up underneath here, okay? And if I pull them hard, they're going to hit my chest. If I pull them real hard, they're going to hit my chest. <laughs> Why you roll your eyes? You don't believe me? Girl, this morning, Callie going to have to come take y'all to school because your, your, your teacher and your schoolhouse is putting me under too much stress as a grandmother, okay? I don't have to deal with all this stress. First, you don't like my hair, my bonnet. You walking away. Now your teacher calling me a toupee, telling you I got on the toupee. This is too, y'all is traumatizing me. They probably talk, she probably talking about his mom's wig because you know his mom will come in here with the wig on backwards and sit in the say I say she don't and sit in the class till he be quiet. Girl, Callie is an old school mama. She do what we did to her, honey. Your mom, we had to sit in your mama's class like that too. All the kids looking like, why your mama in here? Yep, I sat my ass right on the front bench, right on the front row for your mama too. So you ain't, don't feel like you alone. Okay, and I sat right on Dre's desk. Okay, right on top of the desk. Dare him to move. They didn't know how to be still either in the classroom. And don't believe them if they tell you it's that ADHD. No, it's that N-I-G-G-A. Okay, sometimes we just have a little time, struggling time sitting down and listening to people talking about our mama's got on two pays. That's all that is. You just have a little bit more energy than other people. That's why we so good in sports. We just got a little extra bit more energy, okay? So if they tell you you got ADHD, you tell them you got N-I-G-G-A, okay? <laughs> they know what I'm talking about. Tell them your grandmama said it. Thanks for tuning in to Nine Mag TV.